Hello everybody. Welcome to a new let's play my first let's play here on YouTube. And let's play Fear. Uh, Fear is a game that I have, a, I, have a, I have already finished three times I think. I went through three playthroughs and it's a fantastic game. A game that unfortunately I just first played it this year, in the beginning of this year. And I avoided this game for so long because I'm not a huge fan of horror games. You know, I don't like to f feel scared. Uh, so I always thought that it was a horror-based game. Uh, I saw some uh, screenshots at the time, and I thought he, Alma would be just looking for you. You would be running from from Alma, the little girl. And it ended up that it's not like that. And I don't know why, but just recently. I saw a review from, from Fear, I mean this year, and I saw the gameplay and I realized that it seemed to be a really solid shooter and, and I, I read a lot about comments that how praised this game is for its combat and so I love first person, first person shooters so I decided to try it myself, I bought it on GOG on sale and well it's a fantastic game one of the best first person shooters I've ever played. So I decided to go to another playthrough. I was gonna play it to myself. But then I realized well why not record it. Um, you know, posting on YouTube is so easy these days. So we're gonna start a new game. I'm gonna play a motor difficulty. Uh, and there's a reason why uh, is I'm not gonna use slow motion that much. Actually I will try to avoid it uh, a lot because I, I want to try. I'm gonna try to make a point here: is that Fear is a very solid tactical shooter to some extent. Uh, one thing that really caught my attention is I was playing a lot of boomer shooters, you know, dooms and quakes, and all this variation, dust, comedy, evil, and Fear was different. You know, it has accuracy. It feels a little bit like Counter Strike, a little bit. You know, you can control the recoil to some extent, and if you stand still and zoom in, your accuracy, accuracy increases. And I found that fantastic. And I'm, I want to show here that you can play a fear as a tactical shooter and not use the slow motion that much. I, I know it, it would disappoint a lot of people because you know the slow motion is. I think that makes fear fear. <laughs> but so it's gonna be a different playthrough if you never watched a, a playthrough of you before. Maybe this is not a good one to a good one to to start. The unit was named the first encounter a sound Rika. Weird name.
wake you, Senator. It's about Origin. What happened? There was an uprising. Fettel has taken command of the prototypes. My God. We can still resolve this discreetly, but we have to move fast. Oh, all right, all right. Let me make a few calls. This wacko's name is Paxton Fettel. He's the key. If we contain him, we contain the situation. Fucker's got an appetite. I think he has an agenda. It's not just recreational. He's getting something out of it. Essential vitamins and nutrients? What's his story? Property of Armicam Technology Corporation. They're working on a military contract to develop an army of clones that respond to a psychic commander. Top secret, of course. Fettel is one of the commanders. You gotta be fucking kidding me. This is why nobody takes us seriously. Military clones? A full battalion of them. Highly trained and heavily armed. A battalion? What are we supposed to do against a thousand super soldiers? Like I said, we put Fettel down and it's over. Fortunately, the whole point of the program is to give commanders first-hand knowledge of the battlefield without putting them in danger. That means we should be able to corner the bastard without having to wade through all those soldiers. How do we find him? Army came and planted a transmitter in his head. Should lead us right to him. It's awfully convenient. Assuming it does what it's supposed to. What about you, buddy? Ready to go to work? You're putting him in the field? Are you crazy? He just transferred in a week ago. You've seen his training results. His reflexes are totally off the charts. I think he can handle himself. Whatever, man. It's your call. Goddamn right it is. Don't worry. You'll be fine. Let's roll. What's the first thing? You will be a god among men. We've tracked Fettel to an abandoned building just up ahead. No sign of enemy activity on the satellite, but don't take any chances. Jankowski, you in position? Just say the word. All right, move it out. Okay, so here, here it goes, interval one. So that freaky guy there, Paxton Fettel. Looking for him. So the tracking in his head is showing us that he's somewhere in here. Now you guys realized already probably that I'm not playing with, with the default uh, FOV. Uh, it uses a, a vertical FOV, and you have to convert it to a horizontal to know. Yeah, usually. We we know the horizontal FOV. So I used an FOV calculator and it should be around 110 horizontal FOV. Maybe a little bit wider, I don't know. I don't know if you guys like it that way. I don't know if you, some of you might think it's too wide. <laughs> I like it that way. Hey bro, what took you so long? What's up, Jankos? Try to find a way around. Okay, sure thing. Now, uh, I don't remember every single bit of it. I don't know uh, the location of all the health boosters and reflex boosters, all the secrets, all the scares. I don't know if I remember them all, but I know this. Slowly. No rush things. Hold on a sec. You ready? Okay. Uh, 
We need you up here. On my way. Looks like we're too late, boss. Just leftovers. The transmitter signal's coming from nearby. It's gotta be around there somewhere. I'll wait here for Jin. You take a look around. Okay. Do you say so? I'm not playing on um, 280p because the HUD gets really small. Uh, subtitles get really small, and even so, I still think the game, the game graphics, still holds up. A uh, few is a good-looking game. <coughs> so much for great reflexes. The dead man's name was Charles Haberger. I remember him. But are the memories mine or hers? It makes no difference. He deserved to die. They all deserve to die. Come in, over. What's going on? At last metal signal. Comcast is his dead mother. There's a secret dialogue here, if you don't. What do you think of the new point, man? Well, he's pretty cute. It's not what I meant. Just say what's on your mind, Jankowski. I don't know. Something about him just feels... off. The day I look to you as a judge of character will be a sad day indeed. I'm serious. It's something about his eyes. Like he's looking right through you. Maybe it's because you're one-dimensional. Hey, back already? See anything? You guys about done up there? Our day's just getting started. You boys run along. I'll be busy here for a while. Okay, Jim. Come on, make a push! I've tried to forget. I've tried so hard to forget. These men are from fear. They're special attachments to our unit for the duration of this op. They will be on point. Their mission is to assess the nature of the threat. Our job is to keep them alive. Do not engage the enemy. Remember that we are not dealing with ordinary bad guys. Team 1 will move in from the southwest. Team 2 will approach from the north. Once our recon is complete, we'll rendezvous and wait for further orders. Okay, let's saddle up. Go. So, Fado got away. Yeah, he managed to elude the fear imperative in Albert. And I'd send one of my boys, but I think we need a specialist for this one. <laughs> Very funny. Did you find that gate control yet? Nah, uh, yeah. Nobody takes fear seriously. So this is where the game begins. Interval one is just a just an introduction for you to get used to the controls a little bit. You know, try to scare you. <laughs> 
tell you a little bit of a story, the setting. You know. And now it's where the games the game really starts. Ooh, this is not good. Okay guys, I think I'll stop the first episode here. And we'll start from here. Clearly something is not right. And I'll catch up with you guys later.